sisters, welcome to the minor basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawak. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with his grace, and we receive the place of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contain all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Queen of heaven, rejoice. Alleluia. For he whom, whom you did marry to bear, Alleluia. Has risen as he said, Alleluia. Pray for us to God, Alleluia. Rejoice and be glad, O Virgin Mary, Alleluia. For the Lord is truly risen, Alleluia. Let us pray. O God, who gave joy to the world to the resurrection of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, grant we beseech you that through the intercession of the Virgin Mary, his mother, we may obtain the joys of everlasting life through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second glorious mystery, the ascension of our Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. 
Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Glory, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us all trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of the Blessed Virgin Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of her death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To you do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in his folly of tears. Turn then, o most gracious advocate, your eyes of mercy toward us. And after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawak, pray for us. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, most only begotten Son, by His life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life. Grant, we wish it you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve the Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you, and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to the holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our, to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all in the gospel we share to all peoples. By your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is the witness day of the sixth week of Easter. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand.
Lord, open my lips. And my mouth shall declare your praise. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Come, let us sing to the Lord and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him, the dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Come then, let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God and we are his people, the flock his shepherds. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Today listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Meribah and Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, they are a people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger, they shall not enter into my rest. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is risen. Alleluia. Please be seated. The water saw you, O God. You led your people through the sea. Alleluia. I cry aloud to God. Cry aloud to God that he may hear me. In the day of my distress, I sought the Lord. My hands were raised at night without ceasing. My soul refused to be consoled. I remembered my God and I groaned. I pondered and my spirit fainted. You withheld sleep from my eyes. I was troubled, I could not speak. I thought of the days of long ago and remembered the years long past. At night I mused within my heart. I pondered and my spirit questioned. Will the Lord reject us forever? Will he show us his favor no more? Has his love vanished forever? Has his promise come to an end? Does God forget his mercy? Or in anger withhold his compassion? I said, this is what causes my grief, that the way of the Moza has changed. I remember the deeds of the Lord. I remember your wonders of old. I muse on all your works and ponder on your mighty deeds. Your ways, O God, are holy. What God is great as our God. You are the God who works wonders. You showed your power among the peoples. Your strong arm redeemed your people, the sons of Jacob and Joseph. The waters saw you, O God. The waters saw you and trembled. The depths were moved with terror. The clouds poured down rain. The skies sent forth their voice. Your arrows flashed to and fro. Your thunder rolled round the sky. Your glasses light up the world. The earth was moved and trembled when your way led through the sea. Your path through the mighty waters, and no one saw your footprints. You guided your people like a flock by the hand of Moses and Aaron. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord puts to death and raises to life. Alleluia. My heart exalts in the Lord, my horn in it exalted in my God. I have swallowed up my enemies, I rejoice in my victory. There is no holy one like the Lord, there is no rock like our God. Speak boastfully no longer, nor let arrogance issue for your mouth. For an all-knowing God is the Lord, a God who judges deeds. The bows of the mighty are broken, while the tottering gird on strength. The well-fed hire themselves out for bread, while the hungry batten on spoil. The barren wife bears seven sons, while the mother of many languishes. The Lord puts to death and gives life. He casts down the, to the nether world. He raises up again. The Lord makes poor and makes rich. He humbles, he also exalts. He raises the needy from the dust. From the ash heap he lifts up the poor, to sit them with nobles and make a glorious throne their heritage. For the pillars of the earth are the Lord's. He has set the world upon them. 
He will guard the footsteps of his faithful ones, but the wicked shall perish in the darkness. For not by strength does men prevail, the Lord's foes shall be shattered. The Most High in heaven thunders, the Lord judges the ends of the earth. Now may he give strength to his king and exalt the horn of his anointed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The light has dawned for the just. Joy has come to the upright of heart. Alleluia. The Lord is King. Let earth rejoice. Let all the coastlands be glad. Cloud and darkness are His raiment, His throne, justice and right. A fire prepares His path. It burns up His foes on every side. His lightnings light up the world. The earth trembles at the sight. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord of all the earth. The skies proclaim His justice, all peoples see His glory. Let those who serve idols be ashamed, those who boast of their worthless gods, all you spirits worship Him. Zion hears and is glad, the people of Judah rejoice, because of your judgments, O Lord. For you indeed are the Lord, most high above all the earth, exalted far above all spirits. The Lord loves those who hate evil, he guards the souls of his saints. He sets them free from the wicked. Light shines forth for the just, and joy for the upright of heart. Rejoice, ye just, in the Lord. Give glory to his holy name. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. Grant, Almighty and merciful God, that we may in truth receive a share in the resurrection of Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. After Paul's escorts had taken him to Athens, they came away with instructions for Silas and Timothy, to join him as soon as possible. Then Paul stood up at the Areopagus and said, You Athenians, I see that in every respect you are very religious. For as I walked around looking carefully at your shrines, I even discovered an altar inscribed to an unknown God. What therefore you unknowingly worship, I proclaim to you. The God who made the world and all that is in it the Lord of heaven and earth does not dwell in sanctuaries made by human hands, nor is he served by human hands because he needs anything. Rather, it is he who gives to everyone life and breath and everything. He made from one the whole human race to dwell on the entire surface of the earth, and he fixed the ordered seasons and the boundaries of the regions so that people might seek God even perhaps grope for him and find him, though indeed he is not far from any one of us. For in him we live and move and have our being, as even some of your poets have said, for we too are his offspring. Since therefore we are the offspring of God, we ought not to think that the divinity is like an image fashioned from gold, silver, or stone by human art and imagination. God has overlooked the times of ignorance, but now He demands that all people everywhere repent, because He has established a day on which He will judge the world with justice through a man He has appointed, and He has provided confirmation for all by raising Him from the dead. When they heard about the resurrection of the dead, some began to scoff, but others said, we should like to hear you on this some other time. And so Paul left them. But some did join him and became believers. Among them were Dionysius, a member of the court of the Areopagus, a woman named Damaris, and others with them. After this, he left Athens and went to Corinth. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. 
Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Praise the Lord from the heavens. Praise him in the hearts. Praise him, all you his angels. Praise him, all you his hosts. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Let the kings of the earth and all peoples, the princes and all the judges of the earth, young men too and maidens, old men and boys. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Praise the name of the Lord, for his name alone is exalted. His majesty is above earth and heaven. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. He has lifted up the horn of his people. Be this his praise from all his faithful ones. From the children of Israel, the people close to him. Alleluia. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Please stand. I will ask the Father, and He will give you another Advocate to be with you always. The Lord be with you and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus said to his disciples, I have much more to tell you, but you cannot bear it now. But when he comes, the Spirit of truth, he will guide you to all truth. He will not speak on his own, but he will speak what he hears and will declare to you the things that are coming. He will glorify me, because he will take from what is mine and declare it to you. Everything that the Father has is mine. For this reason, I told you that he will take from what is mine and declare it to you. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. May mga tao na nung sila ay napalayo, doon sila napalapit sa atin. Nung sila ay nawala, doon natin nakita ang kanilang halaga. Nung sila ay nagpapaalam, doon natin naramdaman na mahal pala natin sila. Ang ating mga pagbasa ngayong mga araw na to. Mahalata natin na yung tono ng pananalita ng ating Panginoon ay pamamaalam. Nagpapaalam siya. Kasi sa darating na linggo, aakyat na sa salangit, ascension. Iiwan niya na ang mga alagad. Babalik na siya sa tabi ng kanyang ama sa langit. Kaya ang mga alagad ay nalungkot at natakot. Kaya si Jesus ay hindi lang nagpaalam, siya ay naghabilin. Yung habilin kasi, ito yung mga huling salita na binibitiwan ng isang taong nagmamahal para sa kanyang mga minamahal upang sila ay palakasin ng loob, upang turuan ko anong gagawin, upang bigyan ng direksyon ng kanilang buhay. Naalaala ko, nung ako'y Paris Priest, ako'y tinawag upang magbigay ng huling sakramento, last rites. Tawag doon na extreme unction pa noon no? sa isang pasyente sa ospital. At pumunta ako at nakita ko yung pasyente, isang matandang babae, 92 years old. Mahinang mahina, ang daming tubong nakakabit sa kanya. At ang sabi ng Dr. Father, hinintay na lang po niyang oras niya. At binigyan ko siya ng huling sakramento. At pagkatapos kong bigyan siya ng huling sakramento, yung pasyente, kahit mahinang mahina na, tinanggal na yung sandali yung oxygen, at uh, sa marahang boses, tinawag niya yung kanyang mga anak, kasi doon yung anak niya eh, kapaligid sa kanya, sa kanyang kama, sabi niya, alay kayo, alay kayo. Sabi niya, marahang boses, pero narinig. 
Magmahalan kayo ha. Huwag kayong mag-aaway-away ha. Makinig kayo sa kuya ninyo. Yung kapatid niyong may problema, tulungan ninyo. Yung bunso, alalayan ninyo. Yung mga hindi nyo pakaintindihan, yung mamalit na bagay, huwag nyo nang palakihin. Magmahalan kayo. Magtulungan kayo. At ilang araw pa namatay yung babae. At uh, napalapit sa akin yung pamilya. Pagkaraan ng ilang mga buwan, may isang lapit sa akin, isa, isa sa mga kapatid. Sabi niya, Father, nag-reunion kami. Kami makakapatid. Sa simulang saya-saya namin. Pero nung tumagal-tagal na, no, nakainom na yung iba, abay, may nag na ng boses. May gusto nang sumigaw. Hindi, hindi sila may sumisigaw na nga. May pinag-awayan daw sila tungkol sa lupa. Ayan. Kaya ah, tatas na ng boses. Tapos may isang kapatid daw tumayo. Sabi niya, Oy, Oy, shst, shst, shst. anong bilin ng nanay? Anong huling salitang binitiwa ng nanay? At tumahimik silang lahat. Kasi ang mga habilin, ang mga huling salitang binitiwan, matindi yan eh. Umaalingaw-ngaw yan sa atin eh. Hindi yan basta-basta nalilimutan eh. Ang aming ama na si Santo Domingo, siya yung founder o takapagtatag ng aming orden, Dominicans. Nung siya ay malapit na mamatay, nakahiga din siya, mahinang mahina na. At nakapaligid yung mga pare, mga madre, mga mongha sa kan sa uh, uh, higaan niya at nag-iiyakan, malungkot na malungkot. Ang sabi ni Santo Domingo, huwag kayong malungkot sapagkat sa aking paroroonan, mas makakatulong ako sa inyo. I will be of more help to you where I am going. Sa aking paroroonan, mas malaking tulong ang maibigay ko sa inyo. Kaya kami mga Dominicans, Halos gabi-gabi, dinadasal namin ang Ospem Miram. Ano ito? Ito yung dasal patungkol para sa aming ama na Santo Domingo. Sinasabi namin, Amang Santo Domingo, nangako ka na kami tutulungan mo, pagsapit mo sa kabilang buhay. Tukdin mo ang iyong pangako at sa Diyos kami iyong idalangin. At alam niyo, naniwala kami na tinutupad ng aming ama ang kanyang pangako dahil may gitna walong daang taon na kami. Aba, hindi kami pinabayaan. Lalo kami dumadami. Lalo lumalago. Kahit ang daming pagsubok, ang daming problema, ang daming ulos na dumating sa aming buhay. Pero narito pa rin kami. Hindi kami pinabayaan. Tinupad niya ang kanyang pangako. Si Jesus, bago umakyat sa langit, hindi lang habilin, pangako. Anong sabi niya? Huwag kayong matakot. Hindi ko kayo pabayaan. Hindi ko kayo iiwang uli lang. Ipapadala ko ang Espiritu Santo sa inyo. Panggabayan kayo. Huwag kayong matakot. Narito ako lagi. Hindi ko kayo pabayaan. At Tinutupad ng Diyos ang kanyang pangako na yan. Hindi niya tayo pinabayaan. Anong prueba, Pater? Eto pa rin tayo. Kasi kung hindi tinupad ng Diyos ang kanyang pangako, kung pinabayaan tayo, bakante na yung upuan ninyo. Wala na kayo rito. Sa dami ng pinagdaanan ninyo, sa daming problema, mga unos na dumating sa buhay ninyo, muntik-muntikan na kayo. Akala nyo, katapusan na ninyo. Akala nyo, bibigay na kayo. Pero eto pa rin kayo. Ibig sabihin, hindi tayo pinapabayaan ng Diyos. Tinutupad ng Diyos ang kanyang pangako. Kaya dito tayo hugot ng lakas, ng tapang, ng tibay ng loob. Ang ating Diyos, tinutupad ang kanyang pangako sa atin. Tukdin naman natin ang ating pangako sa Diyos. Sitayo po tayo. 
Our Heavenly Father has not left us orphans. He has sent us His Holy Spirit. Let us make our common prayer in the power of the Spirit of Truth. Our response is, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the Church may be zealous in bringing the message of Jesus to all people. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who govern and, ex ex and exercise authority may bring peace and justice to nations. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That through our acts and kindness, the despised, the rejected, or unbeloved in our society may experience God's, God's care in their lives. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick and those who suffer may see and feel God's loving presence. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That those who have gone before us in death may be raised to life of the risen Lord. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For our Pope, College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and for all those whom we promise to pray, we pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For the prior provincial and for brothers and ministry at Bahai Dominico and St. Mary Magdalene, we pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intention of Father Eugenio Cabillion O.P., who is celebrating his profession anniversary today, we pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, and for our personal intentions, we pray, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for the intentions of this Mass, and in the silence of our hearts, we present to the Lord our own personal intentions. Lord, grant that the Holy Spirit may increasingly reveal to us the truths made known by Jesus, who lives with you, now and forever. Amen. Please be seated. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His holy church. O God, who by the wonderful exchange effected in this sacrifice have made us partakers of the one supreme Godhead, grant, we pray, that as we have come to know your truth, we may make it ours by a worthy way of life. Through Christ, 
our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation at all times to acclaim you, O Lord, but in this time above all, to load you yet more gloriously, when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. For with the old order destroyed, a universe cast down is renewed, and integrity of life is restored to us in Christ. Therefore, overcome with Paschal joy, every land, every people, exults in your praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing together, then ending him of your glory as they acclaim. You are indeed the holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice. And once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you've held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Socrates, our Archbishop, Fidelis, his auxiliary bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, 
her most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles, Saint Dominic, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you to your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Stand. Now in loving confidence, we pray to our Father in the words Christ taught us. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be all await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Do not look on our sins but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. We offer each other the sign of peace. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Peace be with you. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. Here is Jesus Christ, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I'm not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Please stand. I have many more things to tell you, but they would be too much for you now. When the Spirit of Truth comes, He will guide you to all truth. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to His people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of His servant, David. Through His holy prophets, He promised of old that He would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember His holy covenant. This was the oath He swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship Him without fear, holy and righteous in His sight, all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. I have many more things to tell you, but they would be too much for you now. When the Spirit of Truth comes, He will guide you to all truth. Alleluia. Let us pray. Graciously be present to your people, we pray, O Lord and lead those you have imbued with heavenly mysteries to pass from former ways to newness of life through Christ our Lord. Amen. We'll now pray the Horatio Imperata for vocations in the Archdiocese of Lingay and Dagupan. Let us turn to Mary, help of Christians for the increase of priestly vocations in the church in Lingay and Dagupan. Let us answer together, grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You accompanied your son on his way to Calvary. Walk with our seminarians in their journey of priestly formation. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You are the mother of the Good Shepherd. Inspire our youth to follow the voice of your son and courageously answer his call to be shepherds. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You were with the apostles in prayer on Pentecost Day. Stay with us in prayer so that the fire of the Spirit may descend on our young men, seeking their vocation in life. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Your Son entrusted to you the beloved disciple at the foot of the cross. Take into your immaculate heart our young men who are reluctant to answer the call to be priests. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Let us pray. Mary, help of Christians, we place all our young men under your motherly protection. Inspire them to serve the church as priests of your Son. Take under your motherly care our seminarians being formed for the priesthood. Accompany with your help, your priest sons, as they follow your Son, who is Lord forever and ever. Amen. Maraming salamat po sa inyong pagdalo sa banal na misa. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our celebration of the Mass is ended. Go to love and to serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Prayer for the blessing of the sick. God the Almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our sickness. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health. To the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Pray prayer for the blessing of religious articles. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ and Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, may these rosaries, candles, images, oil, scapulas, crucifix, and other articles of devotion be blessed and made holy in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.